Hello everybody and welcome back to Neu Minibrun here in Farming Simulator 22. A beautiful map but we're in completely dire straits because as you'll see we have 460 euros and I'm sorry about any flickering I'm trying to avoid it by get, getting to the right angle but one thing that might save us is the crusty bloomer that's on the roof of the greenhouse here. Let's uh, see if we can climb up and uh, and get it because this crusty bloomer is a collectible. And uh, we get 62,500. There's a curious message there about the collectibles. Something about Giants Forum, I'm not, I don't know. But uh, anyway, there's 16 of these collectibles on the map. And they might save us. And I do know where one other one is. And I'm going to just go to it. Uh, it's over here. I think it's at, yeah, here at the sugar mill. So let's visit the sugar mill. And it's on the step here. A little pasty or something. Except it looks a bit like a dog poop or something, but it's not. It's a pasty. So, anyway, let's go back to the farm. And the other thing we have going for us is the um, the iron furnace up here. Because uh, we just filled this up the other day and we have all this metal. And I'd, I'd like to sell this straight away to get some more money in. But the unfortunate thing is, if you look here... There's nowhere to sell metal, so what I'm going to have to do is do a bit of construction, go to construction, and put down a selling point for um, for everything really, everything we can't currently sell. So there's a so there's a sell everything mod here, and I'm just going to put it at the end here. So if you were I mean I do have super strength enabled, but if you didn't have super strength yeah, I'll put it just there. We could, like, get our lorry and push it all over here. But what I'll do is I will use super strength. And I'm just going to put everything in in the sell point. I'm not sure exactly how much. Let's just see how much one goes for. 5,235. And we have a penalty because we haven't started our position farming yet. Which is a bit unfair because we've only just, you know, got here yesterday. And already we have a penalty. So we need to do something about that. And I will do something about that in this episode. But I just want to sell this metal first. And the other production we have at the moment is the the oil mill. Um, so I'll visit that when I've just done this uh, procedure. I think this is the last one. I don't think there's any more. So, let's have a look at our productions. Just here. So, oh uh, yeah, we have the greenhouse as well. And by the way, I want to put another greenhouse just here. Um, like a fruit greenhouse. So we can have olives go into the uh, the oil mill. But let's, let's visit the oil mill first of all. And, yeah, we already have some. What is this? canola oil because we harvested canola yesterday didn't we that's right we don't have olive oil because we don't have any olives at the moment but um do you know what i might i might go and fix that straight away so let's go back to here and let's put down um a greenhouse this one um so 12,500. I'll try and put it somewhere really flat. Do I, can I do it like this or should I do it like this? I need to leave a bit of room actually for... Um, I might put it further this end actually. Uh, Alright, I'll, I'll just choose a spot and I'll, I'll, I'll be back to you. Yeah, I think just here. Because I thought that this area was completely flat and we wouldn't have to pay anything over the cost. We had we paid $98 over the $15,000 uh, sorry, the $12,500 cost. But this is what I wanted. So now we need to fill it up with various things and um I'll do yeah, we need what do we need now? We need let's have a look at our productions actually to, to check. Yeah, this is it. We need seed, solid fertilizer, and herbicide. So first of all, I'm going to put seed and um, solid fertilizer in it. Okay, that is the the uh, seed and the solid fertilizer. And to get it working, we also need herbicide and water. So let's go back to our lorry. And I'm going to go get a big tanker to to, to put water in uh, that greenhouse and the greenhouse here, which, which isn't working because there's no water in it. So I'll see you at the shop. Okay, here we are at the shop. And 
I pretty much found my way here straight away, so I need to get a big tanker. So let's find one. Yeah, this lizard one. Yeah, we'll just hire this. And I'm going to just sort it out and take it up to the um, to the new fruit greenhouse that we've got. I'll see you, I'll see you back there. Okay, so back with the tanker. Um, now I need to cheat a little bit now because I have no way of getting putting water in this in this at the moment. So what I'll need is to fill the vehicle with water. So I'm going to do that, and I'm going to start overloading. Okay, this is the greenhouse pretty much filled up. So you can see it here, 96,000 litres of water in here now. So now I need to go back to the farm to put some um, water in the greenhouse down there uh, because I don't know when else I'm going to do that. So I'll see you back at the farm. Okay, I think that's all, all I need this... Um, this trailer for the uh, the tanker for uh, so with reservations I'm gonna send it back uh, yeah I think so yeah okay right so now what we need to do is to improve our fields because yesterday I'm sorry about the flickering I can't really do anything about it at the moment uh, yesterday where are our fields by the way <laughs> over here I think let's go through the cow through the cows so we harvested, I think it was canola on this field yesterday. It was, yeah. So now we have to analyse and do all the things ready uh, to make it ready for uh, 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 drilling wheat in here in October or September, I, th I think it is. So um, I'm going to get off to the shop again with the, with, the tr with the truck and pick up things like the Azaria Scout. Um, there's also... Um, like a slurry spreader and things like that so um, I'll see you when I'm back here with everything that I need <laughs> oh fantastic yeah just stop there fella that's that's absolutely fine how am I supposed to get in now <laughs> okay <laughs> Right, this is all the stuff I need. Uh, now, I, I've realised I've forgotten to put herbicide in the fruit greenhouse that we just bought, but um, I can do it with this John Deere um, sprayer that we've got here. So, uh, we've got everything here. Let's not zoom in. And also, I have, I've had to turn on the, the, the month to July, uh, the month of display to July, because I was getting terrible flickering. I, I don't want to, uh, you know, impose that on anybody. So... All right, let's get the first thing down, which is the, uh, yeah, the Azaria Scout, and I'll see you over at the field. All right, so the f f you probably know this, but the first thing you have to do with precision farming is to analyse your field, which uh, we haven't done so far. So let's unfold this. You must have seen one of these by now, the Azaria Scout. So it's all unfolded. And uh, let's do the first prod and then uh, I'll put it on a bit of a time lapse after that. But uh, let's just do the first prod. Brilliant. Okay, well, I'm going to do these two fields and I'll see you when they're done. Okay, just one more prod, and we've done all the uh, prodding that we need to. Um, I just want to check and see our precision farming score. 
uh, on these fields. Where are we now? Just down here. Yeah, 50 and 40. I thought the, the lowest was 50, actually, but it's 48 on this one. So, anyway, let's... Uh, how do we... I need to analyse the field now. I'm not entirely sure how to do it. Let's have a look. Yeah, send soil for analysis. Okay, let's wait and see. Okay, here we are. So let's go back to this. Yes, very, very good. So there's no silty clay in here and it's all, what is it, sandy loam and loam and a tiny, tiny little bit of loamy sand. So <laughs> very good. Well, our scores haven't gone up. You know, there's still kind of this. So we need to now, uh, I will fold up the this and I might need it if we buy another field, which we might do. I mean, I want to buy this grass field here. Um, so I'll, I'm going to keep the Azaria Scout, but for now I'm going to go and fetch the the slurry spreader. Okay, I haven't done my normal thing of uh, standing on the field, so let's do that first of all. Uh, this field, we know it's got good soil in it, but uh, the pH is okay and the nitrogen is pretty low so we need, do need to do something about it as usual. Now I've been looking around for other fields to buy because we've got these two fields here which are quite small. I'd like to have sugar, I would like to have a sugar field and sugar is ready to harvest in October and it's September now and there's one field that I found, yeah you can see here actually sugar beet ready to harvest in October. There's one field I found which is 23 which is here so I would like to buy this and to have it to harvest in uh, October. That's 96,000. So I won't do that now, but I would like to buy that before October. Uh, so hopefully we can do that with the money from the the metal or from the oil mill or, or whatever. Uh, so anyway, let's get um, let's get organized here and then we can go. All right, so I have to use power tools to fill fill the vehicle with slurry. And that's it. So, all right, I'll do this on the time lapse as well. I actually really like precision farming. I, I feel it's very satisfying and, uh, you know, improving the soil and everything. And it's a real thing as well. Uh, I remember seeing a program about it on the BBC. If, wherever you are in the world, you can probably get the BBC, you know, iPlayer. And there's a country file episode all about precision farming. And um, it was very, very interesting. And two farmers side by side, one of them doing it, one of them not. So, um, I'd rec highly recommend watching that if you're in at all into, you know, farming or whatever. Uh, so, uh, now this, these two fields are all done. I just, I'm curious to see actually the score, the precision farming score now. It hasn't gone up. It was 48 and 50 to start with. And what's the thing there? That's, the top one is nitrogen, which we put on. And the third one down is weed control and tillage as well okay so we're we're losing scores on all those but we haven't finished yet we need to still put lime on the fields and also to drill the fields but what i need to do now is to go and pick up a lime spreader and while i'm doing it i'm going to go back to the the iron furnace um to go oh, where am i going I'm, i <laughs> i know my way to, to this farm but i don't know my way around the farm I'm going to go back to the iron furnace, not the iron furnace actually, the, the fruit greenhouse, to fill that up with herbicide um, and I'm going to take the, the John Deere sprayer with me uh, and I also need to pay for a lot of things like the slurry and all the seed and fertiliser I've used. Now I'll put this back in the shed and I'll get everything organised to, to, to be on my way.
Okay, this is everything organised. Um, right, I'll go first to the fruit greenhouse and then I'll have to make my way to the shop to pick up the, the lime spreader. So I'll see you at the fruit greenhouse. Alright, so here we are. And this is the missing piece of the puzzle. Because uh, we just need to put herbicide in here. And after I've done this, I will pay for everything that I've taken because I've taken quite a lot of stuff and not paid for it like the the slurry and all the stuff I put in this um, yeah let's put let's uh, attach this yeah all the stuff I put in this greenhouse so uh, right okay um, all right let's do fill vehicle again fill vehicle with herbicide yeah and that's 3360 litres of herbicide let's put this in Right, I've actually put in 10,000 litres of herbicide because otherwise we'd have to keep coming back here all the time uh, with this to put herbicide in. So um, now we need to switch on the production. Let's go to productions and go to, yeah, it's going to be olives and we'll turn it on and we'll have olives distributing to the olive mill. And so this should make us some money now because in the olive yeah olive oil we'll put that on to produce and materials missing for, for now but they'll soon start uh, producing so I need to calculate all the money that I've spent and pay it so just give me a minute to do that okay I calculate that it's twelve thousand seven hundred and twenty dollars and that's for everything we put in here and all the slurry so uh, okay so the final thing to do today is to lime the field so I'm gonna to go to the shop and pick up the lime spreader and get back to the field and I'll see you when we're back at the field okay here we are with the lime spreader but unfortunately I've run out of time, so we'll have to do this next time. I'll just line this up at the field. Like so. It's not a very... It doesn't have much width to it, this what this lime spreader. So, thanks very much for watching today. Um, we'll get the lime spreading done next time. And we'll probably be buying that sugar, uh, that sugar field. And also drilling uh, barley, I think, in, in these two fields. So there's lots to do. And uh, thanks for joining me and see you next time. Bye for now.